French desserts have a terrible reputation for being really difficult to make. And I have to say, some of them really are. Like dacquoises, I never need to make them at home. But I'm gonna make a really easy French dessert. There are a few steps to this, but it's really worth doing. First, take a half a cup of sugar and add a pinch of salt to stir them together. Pour it over a flat surface, like a cutting board or slab of marble or the kitchen countertop. Then unfold one sheet of puff pastry. You've actually defrosted it overnight in the refrigerator. Be sure it's still really cold. Then take another half a cup of sugar and add a quarter of a teaspoon of good ground cinnamon to it and mix that in and sprinkle it over the puff pastry. Lightly roll the dough out until it's a 13 inch square and the sugar is pressed into the pastry lightly on the top and the bottom. Fold each side of the square towards the center so they each go halfway to the middle. Then fold them again so the two folds meet exactly in the middle of the dough. Then finally fold one half over the other half as though you were closing a book. Slice the dough in 3 8 inch slices. You'll want to do this with really cold dough and a really sharp knife and actually use the knife in a sawing motion so you're not pressing down on the dough. Then place them cut sides up on baking sheets lined with parchment paper. Okay, into the oven, 450 degrees for six minutes. It's a really hot oven, and they're gonna come out golden brown and caramelized. Then turn them over the spatula and bake them for another three to five minutes. Be careful, they're really hot. There's an amazing pastry shop in Paris called La Doree, and they make these huge palmiers. They're my favorite. But this is just a cookie. I want to make it into a whole dessert. You just pour two half pints of fresh raspberries into a bowl, sprinkle over two tablespoons of sugar and two tablespoons of orange flavored liqueur. Give everything a big stir. What I like to do is lightly mash half the raspberries to bring out their juices, and then let them sit for about an hour until the raspberries are soft and juicy. I mean, you can put it in a bowl, but it looks a little more special in a glass. Big dollop of creme fraiche. Very French and a pommier. Now, what Frenchman wouldn't be happy with that? We've got a really easy, really stylish French dessert. And a pommier. Mm. It's a great dessert.